my nice mic on. Got some lights on. Lights. Camera. Action. All that nonsense. Got me a coffee. Oh gee. Hello everybody. How are you? Man, I've been the most lazy, lazy person today. It's absolutely ridiculous. But let's see how the how the slots go today. <laughs> God damn it! Every time Wolfie is the only person who's actually won anything on these goddamn slots. Nope, that's not how this works. Gee, that's right. That's right. All right, we're starting off on a win. We're at least getting something. We're getting something here, but we're going to be playing Stardew Valley today, as I'm sure you probably know. I got my nice mic. Hopefully, hopefully it sounded nice for you. And yeah, uh, it's been a bit of while since I've played Stardew, so I'm keen to just jump jump straight on into it. And I've also won won some points, some irrelevant points. I love it. All right, let's move over. Yeah, there we go. These start screen clicks are so loud. All right, so the plan for to oh, let me let me get my phone out with the chat. Let's pause time, yeah. Yes, time is paused. This is good. There you go, one viewer. How are you? All right, I got the chat up. How's your day been? Let's get into it. This, what's happened? It's been a while. It's been like more than two days. I can't remember a thing. <laughs> oh, Pixkite, how are you, bro? It's been a while. I'm sorry. This is a different game. I'm sorry if it, if it's a shock to the system. <laughs> and how how are levels at the moment? Is this? Bloody game, like, seriously. Let's, Let's try something like this. Sorry, just do a little bit of uh, on the spot levels checking. All right, here we go. Here we go. Ball okay. G. That should be good yet. Yeah. All good. All right. Check out my farm. All right, we got a heap of random stuff in there. My furnaces. That's all good. I need to check my weather. Have you ever played um, Stardew Valley, Pixkite? Or is it? Or is it Pix Kit? I apologize if I've been saying your name wrong this whole time. But we got clear and sunny days tomorrow, so I'm gonna have to be watering my bloody plants. We got a little bit of extra luck today, which is actually pretty good. You like it? That's awesome. De like, I don't know, I don't know how how old you are, but like back in the day. There were these games called Harvest Moon, and they were pretty much this game. Um, but like, there's a lot of things in this game that I always wished were a thing back in the day when I was playing Harvest Moon. So it's really awesome to see, like, sprinklers. Sprinklers are a thing in this game that back in the Harvest Moon days, I was like, man, 
Why don't they have sprinklers? It makes so much sense. I'm on a damn farm. Why wouldn't I have sprinklers? So yeah, now in this game we got sprinklers and I love it. You got crafting, got lip like got leveling up, you got skills, all sorts of stuff. And, you know, all the usual fishing, mining, all that too, so it's good stuff. I love it. Um We got we got extra luck today. Nothing else on TV. And my plan my plan at the moment is to make just a ridiculous amount of money. Look at all the stuff I've got that I can craft. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh. No, don't get distracted. So the plan is... Oh, there's more stuff. The plan is to make a ridiculous amount of money, get the, uh, the third level backpack so that I've got all this extra space down here that I can hoard with. Because that's that's what I love to do. Dear Loki, I saw an article about you in the local paper. It sounds like the country life is a good fit for you. I'm so proud of you. Take care, sweetie. Love, Mum. Oh. All right, welcome to my farm. Oh, yo, we got pe we got peppers. We got the preserves going. Oh, we got like little bubbles coming up. But yeah, I think I overextended myself with the amount of crops I put down. I really need to upgrade this um, watering can. But now that I'm into summer, like, I just need to start growing crops and getting all the stuff for the community center, you know? Yo, Brabus! I get the top pack pack as soon as possible. I wish they had more space in the inventory. Yeah. Nah, that's fair. Like... I don't know, I just... Like... I wanted, I wanted to get, I wanted to get my chicken coop and stuff going. I love to have the chicken coop. Got another tree in here we can take down. Alright. So say hello to, uh... We got, I think this is Nugget. Yes, I got it right. And Henry Eddie. Yes. May as well let him out. Trixie Bell. Yeah. <laughs> I need to remember my my bloody animals' names, otherwise what kind of farmer am I? Out you come, guys. Alright, so the plan. Oh, gotta say hi to Yogi. Plan is, do some foraging, go nuts on fishing, and I swear I saw wormies over here. Yep. Let's just... Bloody stone. What a waste of time. Oh my god, yes! Oh, oh man, thick. Oh, thick. Alright. Pixkite, have you ever played Dungeons and Dragons? I, I really hope you have, because it's the best thing in the world, I swear. Alright, foraging. That's the that's the plan. Let's just do a little clearing. A little bit here and there. Nope. That's wood. But yeah, I can't get distracted. I need forageables and fish. We need money. But yeah, anyway, so, like, D&D, Dungeons and Dragons, it's the best thing in the world. If you've never played it before, you should definitely watch Critical Role. <laughs> let me just, let me just plug them as well. But, basically, I was playing a character, which was like a, a, a crow person, called Fixian, 
and uh, yeah, he was disintegrated by an undead floating eyeball and forever ingrained in, my, in our memories for how awesome he was and not for how brutal he was. All right. So I got a few, got a few things. Oh man, what am I doing? I got all this stuff in my, in my inventory. I need to throw in the shipping box. God damn. <laughs> Look at the chickens all just chilling in the sun. How you going, Yogi? Alright, here we go. Yeah, yeah. I'll just. That should be enough space. Haven't played it, but I've considered playing. I highly recommend giving it a go. If you've got. Like, I mean, yeah, it depends on depends on the, the people that you play with, because it's very much a group, it's a group game, game, and like, yeah, the people that you play with very much influence your experience with it, but yeah, if you got awesome people to play with, man, so good, it's the best. Yeah, we're just gonna like, we're just gonna go so hard fishing today. Yeah, Brabus knows what up. Brabus is the name of that guy's D and D character. <laughs> That's how deep it is. And how are you, third viewer? How's your day been? H hope you've been well. Green algae, god damn it. Let's eat that. <sighs> Sit here with me, Kappa. Whoa. I'm one hand in it. And we got treasure as well. Whoa. Oh, he's a lively one. Oh, come here. It's alright, it's alright. Let me get the treasure. Let me get the treasure. Back on the fish. There we go. See these skills? Oh. It's alright, mate. It's alright. Oh, God. I should probably put down the kappa. Oh. 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 Easy. See? That's how you do it. Ooh. A ruby. Nice. Or is Tim the name of Brabus' real-life character? Oh man. Don't do that to me. Oh, it's alright mate, it's alright. There we go. So recently I've started hearing ABBA and I'm surprised to say I haven't been hating it. When I was growing up, my mum used to play ABBA so much that it got to the point where I could not deal with any more ABBA in my life ever again. Oh, God damn it, more trash. But recently... I've been hearing it and I'm like, yo, this is actually not too bad. <laughs> I'm tapping my foot. What is happening? I'm getting old. I'm changing. I'm willing to eat green algae nowadays. Boy, Brabus. 
What do you remember about Fixshan the most? What's the most memorable Fixshan moment for you? Cause I know, I know, I know a couple for me. <laughs> I definitely bit off more than I could chew with that character though in terms of like repeating other people's statements and stuff like that. That was, yeah, that was maybe a bit much. Ooh. Oh, get the treasure. Here we go, here we go. And back on the fish. There we go. Got the skills. Pro fisherman over here. Yo, calm down, mate. Calm down. Death pecking the eye out of the guy he just killed. <laughs> oh, and a diamond. Yo, weak. Man, amidst all this trash in this pond, we're finding some diamonds. Okay. Yeah, that was a, that was a good one. I mean, I remember just like digging into his body a bit more than that. He was a brutal character, that's for damn sure. Ooh, that was quick. That fish was waiting. Oh, and we got the treasure right there too. Jeez, how easy. Calm down. Oh, mate. I'm gonna be rich. Whoa. Let's have a feed. I should actually be watching my stamina as well. I haven't watched it at all. I've just been going hard. But yeah, some of the other memories of mine are fixed. Like, because... Obviously, he hated you, just some random human who out of nowhere just busted wings. Whoa, man, it's so quick. And yeah, I remember there was that one time where I was just like, why don't you go grow, like, why don't you just grow wings and fly up there? There was one moment that I was just like, yeah. I like this guy. <laughs> I can't wait for when you get a dinosaur egg. They are very cute. They are a museum artifact, but please don't make the mistake of donating your first one. Make sure you hatch it. I mean... <laughs> I mean... You need to just hold the phone right there, my bro. You can't just say dinosaur egg and hatching it. And... Let me catch this bloody fish and slow down slow down mate I got a, I got a dinosaur hatch hatching egg situation to clear up got so so you're telling me not only do you get a dinosaur egg in Stardew Valley but you can hatch it into a baby dinosaur. Ah, uh, like, is is that what you're telling me? <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna be able to handle this, eh? <laughs> I thought Starbound was too much. I'm going to have a baby dinosaur. Fuck yeah, okay. Okay, thank you for that advice. Oh my god, this changes everything. <laughs> oh. We're going to have a dinosaur. Oh. It's alright, mate, it's alright. Get the treasure. Whoa, a bit too much. More emerald? 
Let's grow. We're gonna be rich just off fishing. Can't stop streaming until we get ourselves a T-Rex. Well now hold on. <laughs> hold on, I'm not I'm not what I once was, mate. I can't do all nighters like I used to. There were there were days where <laughs> I'm laughing at the ridiculousness of this. Oh wait, I donated my first one to the museum because the category said artifact, so I didn't know you could hatch it. Oh man, okay. I'll learn from um from your from your regrets. Wait, what was I talking about? I had a good anecdote, I swear. Yeah, yeah, all right. <laughs> Back in the day, there was a game, Baldur's Gate 2, I think it was, on PlayStation 2. Me and my mate, he'd like come over to my house and we'd grab the kettle and the coffee and sugar and just take it into my room and just sit there making like 15 coffees in a night. Just ridiculous amounts of coffees, staying up all night playing this game. It was the best. But I'm an old man now. I'm older. I'd love to say I'm wiser. <laughs> but, you know. That's always a matter of opinion. Getting a bit of green algae though. This is alright. Just like filling me up. But this changes everything. I will definitely hatch this dinosaur egg. Is it like, yeah, I'm assuming it's something you might find in like the mines? Still don't know if any of the other trash is youth useful at the moment. Like I, I'm keeping keeping a hold of driftwood, just because Leah seems to be a fan of it for some reason. Maybe she makes carvings or something out of it. That'd be cool. But um, yeah, I haven't seen. I don't know if anybody else is a uh, is a fan of trash. So I'm not sure if it's worth holding on to just yet. Perfect. Whoa. So quick. Pretty much been fishing all day and I've still got energy thanks to this green algae. How good. I might just start, yeah. Stop piling algae. You can find them in the skull cavern. Ah, uh, okay. I'm assuming that'll be way down the track for me. Whoa. Whoa. Keep all of your trash? Alright! As a hoarder, I'm not... I'm not gonna say no. And Sam likes Joja Cola. Thank you. I'll write that down in one second. You can find him in the skull cap after the original lines. Or if you dig the worms up, you can rarely find one. Awesome. Oh, no. Oh, mate. A bit close there. Oi, 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 oi. Oi. Bloody skills, mate. 17 pike? 17 gold star pike? How good is this? Ah, uh, 
yeah, it's going to be sunny tomorrow. That's fine. All right. All right. Let's just hold up one second. Let me throw in... Yeah, so I do have some trash just sitting in there already. That's all good. Green CD. That there. Now, I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure I've already got an emerald for the um the community uh, not the community center the 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 museum. So I might just oh yo check it out. Oh pickled radish, yes. All right, we're gonna sell the fish, sell the pickled radish. I'm gonna hold on to. I'm gonna hold on to these just in case. If you don't keep your trash, you'll be spending days fishing for pure trash late game. Oh man, yeah. How ridiculous would that be? After all this time complaining about it, and then in the end, you need it. <laughs> it's like I hate you so much, trash. Cool. Um, that's it. That's it. Time for bed. All right. Good night, everybody. Level seven fishing. See, man, I've been going hard on the fishing. But it's so worth it. Oh, let me just turn turn some levels down on that. A treasure hunter. Okay. Man, I'm rich. Two hundred and fifty gold for an emerald. Man, just smashing pikes, bro. Oh. 